Hey guys, Roman Supersack here, back again doing another news update video for you guys. This one's probably going to be short and sweet because there isn't much to talk about other than the new skin, the Winter War Castro, that's coming in update 1.25 to the Halcyon Fold. Uh, we did have the Winter War Catherine revealed. We already had it from last season, but then she got revisited with a new color palette. And so now we have Winter War Catherine as well as her accompanying buddy here. Winter War Kestrel coming an update 1.25. You can see here in the splash chart, she has a sort of full body armor uh, with or full body suit with some armor around her legs or, or her elbows, uh, maybe even around her waist a bit. Um, definitely like the, the aesthetic appeal of it. It reminds me of some sort of uh, reference to like the modern day technology, not so much the steampunk slash fantasy feel that you normally see in Vainglory. Uh, but more so, more in tune with what we would see on some of our, you know, special forces, whatever it may be, if they were to visit some sort of cold-like area like Russia or whatever it may be. Now, granted, they wouldn't have a compound bow unless they're just that good of a shot. <laughs> uh, I, I guess it's definitely great for uh, quiet, or quiet and quick kills, but... Um, uh, I would definitely say that this definitely reminds me of that type of attire, the more modern day type of equipment that you'd see on some of our special forces. She has a night vision goggles. She has, you know, a very, a very similar type of uh, attire that I would probably think would be seen on some of the special forces as far as how it looks in general. Um, but yeah, I mean, it looks pretty cool. Uh, and then you can see here, she definitely has See, I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying to see if she has any kind of difference as far as her actual uh, personal being here, not her attire, but maybe her face. Does she? Does she always have blonde hair? I don't know. Kestrel, Kestrel, Vainglory. Images. Yeah, she's always had blonde hair. Okay. Yeah. So she she still has the same face, same eyes, whatever it may be. Uh, the ears are covered, so you can't really see that. Uh, but yeah, it looks pretty sweet. So let's go ahead and go down to the model itself. Uh, so there we go. She has that metallic and gold-like compound bow there, as well as the actually pretty large night vision goggles. Uh, and then she has that backpack along her back, and then the full body suit looking pretty awesome. I'm definitely interested in seeing what the abilities look like in-game. Uh, as far as what I see here, I, I definitely think that it looks like it's going to be an amazing skin. Uh, I wasn't much of a fan of the Summer Party Kestrel, personally, so this one's kind of like um, a, a recovery on SCMC's uh, part <laughs> from that skin. I, I don't know, I felt like the, uh, the Summer Party Kestrel was lacking in animations. The, the skin itself was kind of cool, but the animations associated with it was like meh. I hate the fact that she swam. I hate the fact that her butt stuck out when she ran, like she had to stick up her butt. It was kind of weird, you know, I didn't really like it. And so uh, this one, hopefully it doesn't have anything awkward like that as far as movement and animations. Um, and hopefully they're, you know, they're pretty refined and look pretty badass. Uh, I'm assuming they're gonna be some sort of blue projectile. I think normally they are already, but I think it's gonna be a bit more of the cold-like blue, uh, a bit more of the, uh, like the blue is similar to how it looks like in the lenses of her night vision goggles type of thing. I think normally it's more of a darker blue. Um, if I can recall any sort of, yeah, it looks like it's a darker blue maybe. And then I think it's going to be a bit more associated to the cold. So you might see some mist come off her, her, her ultimate or something like that, or maybe some uh, mist trails uh, off her, um, her glimmer shots. I'm interested to see what the actual stealth looks like too. Um, maybe it'll have um, some cool holographic type of stuff. I don't know. Maybe because she's like more futuristic rather than fantasy now. I don't know. But uh, yeah, it's, it looks pretty sweet. So let's go ahead and go over what the changes are exactly. Uh, it says here, skin highlights, compound bow. Of course, that's her signature weapon. She has a night vision goggles with green glowing laser. So I, I guess there's going to be a laser pointed in front of her wherever she runs. She has the Moly Backpack, or Mole, I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm really bad at pronouncing words that have interesting spelling. <laughs> Fur-lined winter uniform, so yeah, we have a winter uniform with that fur lining on the, the hoodie there, uh, keeping her nice and toasty from the cold. Uh, but there we go, so we have the Winter Wear Kestrel coming 
soon to a uh, Halcyon Fold near you. I'm pretty excited about it because I play a lot of Kestrel personally. Um, one, because she's meta. <laughs> you can't rank unless you do a meta, otherwise you're going to have a bad time. You're going to lose a lot. Um, unless you're just that good. Uh, whereas I suck. I only play certain heroes and those I only do okay with. Um, but yeah, so there we go. Excited. Hopefully you guys are too. Uh, I'm definitely going to have a... I wish there was like a third party or a third member, I should say, that had a Winter War skin because then I would do like a Winter War composition. So maybe like... I'm trying to think what would be a Winter War. Maybe like a, a Celeste. And Celeste is associated with the Queen. And so are the um, the what are, what is like the the, the storm guard, which is Catherine and Kestrel, and there was more I think. Um, they're all associated with each other, so I was hoping maybe they'll have like a storm or winter war cast or Celeste. But then again, Celeste has too many skins, so scratch that idea. <laughs> maybe like a winter war Arden, like Arden actually went to the dark side and became a winter war soldier. <laughs> <laughs> it reminds me of Captain America now, but he became like a Winter War soldier uh, to work for the Queen alongside Catherine and Kestrel. That'd be kind of cool, you know. So, but then again, like, how would that work? I guess you would have Kestrel in lane, Arden as a jungler, and then Catherine as a roam. That'd be kind of cool. Uh, and then maybe when Arden punches, it'd be like you know, ice comes off or whatever it is. And then like, yeah, oh, and then like the gauntlet can be like a a like a ring of ice. That'd be pretty cool. So as soon as he drops it, it's like a ring of ice. And, you know, once people walk through it, like it breaks through, whatever. I don't know. I, I think the idea has a, a solid chance of being pretty cool. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this update video of the Winter War Cast, Joel. You'll definitely see this on my videos because I'll be ranking with it. And I'll be probably playing quite a bit of Cast, Joel for a while unless she gets like super heavily nerfed. Uh, but hopefully you guys enjoyed I'll see you guys next time. Later!